and welcome back to my channel. So today we are stuffing um, our Bills binder here, one of our Bills binders, and one of our um, variable expenses. So we let's get started. First off, let's see how much we are supposed to have and see if we have what we're supposed to have. <coughs> Excuse me. We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69. So we have $269. So that sounds right. So let's get stuffing. So first up we have our um, variable expense of you guys. Oh, talking is hard today. <laughs> Talking is hard. Um, first, we have our variable expenses. So if you're new here, go ahead and let us know. Are you joining the budget community? Are you just starting? Maybe you just like watching. Uh, go ahead and leave us a comment below and let us know where you are, what you're doing, all of the things. Let's move this one out of the way for now. So... Right. Well, if you're new here, welcome. Welcome to our channel. We do budgeting and family vlogs and recipes and cooking and guys, we do all the things here on this channel. Um, so if that's something you're all about, go ahead and hit that subscribe bo bo button for us. We are secretly trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Um, but in the meantime, let's get stuffing. We have groceries. Groceries isn't getting anything. My husband was just at the store this morning. And we were also there a few days ago. <laughs> so, as you all know, gas is going to um, our car payment if we have leftover gas money. So, we are going to put, we had $10 last week as well. So, we have this week um, is our last week because it will be our last Tuesday when we go to fill up. Um... And so we will see if we have anything left over. I kind of think we probably will not because I did um, use more gas. We went to the movie Under American Underdog, you guys. It's a Kurt Warner story. If you haven't seen it, it's phenomenal. The movie's great. It was lovely. I cried. You know, all the things. All the things, guys. Um, so this $10 is from last week. We will take that out and set that aside for now. Um, we will put that in. We will put this in here into car payment um, when we get over to our other binder. So we have just this week, and so if even if we don't hit anything, you guys, we have put a good chunk into car payment. And um, I think I will be going to the bank maybe tomorrow, um, and I think I'm going to bring that extra car payment money with me um, when I go, and whatever's in there is what we will um, give to her tomorrow. Not a full car payment, but I am going to the bank, so I might as well. I don't go to this bank, particular bank, very often. Um, so when I do, I might as well bring that with me. So, with that being said, let's get stuffing our $60 into gas. $20, $40, $60 goes into gas. So we are going to put that in there. Um, his gas is going to get 30 so 20 30 $30 is going into his gas. Then we have fast food. It is Tuesday. We are about to go get some grilled cheese, so we better stuff our grilled cheese money in there so that we can do that. $40 goes into fast food. Then we also have personal. Personal for the first time, you guys is going to get two dollars i'm really trying to stuff all the envelopes lately guys i always neglect all these envelopes leave them empty so i'm really trying to put something in everything so two dollars goes into personal two dollars will go into self-care and beauty so one two two dollars going in there then we have movies Movies is going to get $5. I did not take the money out of here when we went to the movies. I had set aside other money um, for that. We also took my son, Owen. We also took Owen um, and his little friend, um, and we went to the Grizzly hockey game on Saturday. So we did the movies, 
in the hockey game all on the hundred dollars I had set aside so that's good so we are gonna put we put our five dollars into movies I forgot to see how much we had in movies now we have five six seven eight dollars we've eight dollars into movies and um, there's another movie that I want to see um, not a full-blown family movie um, but another movie that I want to see that's coming up in February we'll see if I go to that or not um, otherwise there we're kind of waiting for some of the kid ones to be released which you know aren't happening until spring so Noah is not getting anything this week we will be stuffing him soon as he is going to be doing um, track here soon Owen we are going to be putting $20 in his so we have 20 30 30 dollars and his is due I paid mine um, but his is due here we are going to pay his on Monday so we will be doing that um, Layla Layla will also be getting um, some money we will be putting $15 into Layla so 10 15 10 15 and 20 so now she has $20 in hers um, that is for those extra three things that we haven't got yet um, we did get her roller guards but she's still wanting new hockey gloves um, a new hockey water bottle and guys I'm lacking in one thing what is it a water bottle skate guards oh laces she wants a different color laces you guys in her skates um, so we are going to be doing that for her soon all right and then we are going to be putting sixty dollars into Samira because she has her very first competition here in just a couple of weeks and there will be photos to purchase of her competition and so I want to make sure that I have funds set aside specifically for that and anything else to get her flowers and her teddy bear and all of the things that she needs when um, we have that competition. So wish her luck. It is less than two weeks away now, um, but that is all we have for our variable binders for the week. Um, also, we will be stuffing our bills binders, so let's swap these out. Alrighty. I have some exciting news when it comes to our bills binder, you guys. All right. So first up, we have rent. That has already been paid. You know, you guys get the gist. It never really gets stuffed. Eventually, maybe it will be. Car payment. Um, we are going to be putting this $10 into car payment. So let's see what we have. All right. We have 50 60, 70, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85. We have $85 in car payment. All right, so we will be taking that with us, I think. Tomorrow, if we go down, you guys, my mom needs um, her sewer is frozen, and so we are going to go down there and help her with that. Um, hopefully, the guy is coming today, and then we're going to go down there, and everything will be fixed up tomorrow, hopefully. We'll see. Fingers crossed, you guys. All right, so car insurance. I am so excited to tell you that car insurance has been paid in full for the next six months. So we are currently um, stuffing it to pay this next six months. But we have, oh my gosh, you guys, I really need to switch out this envelope because I could never get into it. I broke off the little doohickey and, you guys, why? It's always so hard. All right, there we go. All right, I broke it off, you guys. I really gotta switch that envelope out. So car insurance, now we are focusing on paying car insurance when it comes due again in six months for the next six months. So I have, and I, I know the amount for six months, and so we have a good jump on it. Um, so we are going to be putting $3 into car insurance. So one, two, three. But our next car insurance is not due until mid-August, so we don't have to worry about it for quite a while. I think it's mid-August. Yes, mid-August, I believe. So we have 20, 30. Let me try that again. You guys, counting is hard. 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. So $35 in car insurance, so that is good. We are good there. I really should snap it all the way and it wouldn't be so hard to get into you guys phone phone is not getting anything I just paid my phone like I said I just paid Rockbox so we're not stuffing in there anything in anything in there right now quick trip we are gonna put two dollars into quick trips um, not a whole lot but 
just a little bit in there. It's not due for a while yet. So same with credit card. We are going to be putting 25 into credit card. Um, so 20 and 5. We already paid our last credit card, 125 we paid towards it. So not too shabby there. And then our last $5 will be going into student loans. Oops, wrong way. Student loans. And that will be getting our $5. We can make our monthly payment for that. Um, and then nightly. Nightly, you're going to notice that that is a brand new envelope. So I will be stuffing $100 in here weekly. Um, and sometimes it might actually make it in here, or sometimes I'll just give it to my husband and that will they'll just stay in his wallet. Um, this is for when he stops at night to get milk or water or pop or bring me breadsticks or whatever the case is. When he comes home from work, he always has, I usually have something, then, hey, could you grab this? Could you pick this up? So he'll stop at the local gas station um, and bring stuff home. And so $100, um... For a week and that is extreme you guys I don't think we spend that much but I want to have it there on the off chance that we need it for whatever it is now here's my question for you guys what would you do with the extra leftover each week where would you put it would you put it in vacation funds would you put it in groceries because technically that's why we usually don't stuff any any in the groceries in our variable expi uh, binder because we've either already been there or he brings stuff that we need, little stuff here and there, um, home when he comes home. So where would you where would you stick that extra nightly money? <coughs> <coughs> Guys, where would you where would you put that? Would you put it in groceries? I feel like that might be an appropriate binder to put that in. But that's what we have for. Um, our bills and for our variables for this week we are not putting anything in uh, the other bills binder or any of our other binders right now um, just these two today we will be stuffing more binders here in a couple of days these are the binders that we decided to stuff first so these are the ones um, specifically this one that I now need to go to the gas station and get grilled cheese and all of the things for the kiddos so some of the and, and fill up my car um, and so we are headed out to do that. So until we see you guys in the next one, have a good day. Bye-bye, guys.